You bold escaped criminal. How dare you come here? General, you mistake me for someone else. I'm only a common person. Shut up! There is no mistake. Don't try to deceive me. Come, take him now. You can all leave. I want to try this suspect alone. Prince, can you still recognize me? General, you have mistaken me for another. I am only a common person, like the grass under your feet. I'm not a prince. You saved my life, Prince. How could I not recognize you? But I do not know you, General. Prince, can you still remember a year ago at Shangjun, a commander who drank to excess and breached military discipline? He was due to be beheaded, but your highness forgave his capital crime and just demoted him and banished him to the frontier garrison at Yangzhou. Your highness did that out of consideration for the commander's great achievements in the offensive against the Huns. Ah, yes, I remember. Kong Gang, is it you? Exactly. I arrived at this place and was soon promoted to commander of the county. A few days ago, I heard that your highness was ordered to commit suicide by the emperor. I thought I would never see your highness again in my life. Nor could you have expected that today I would be your prisoner. Alas, it is a sad state of affairs. Your Highness has misunderstood me. I worried that someone in the city might recognize you. Therefore, I had to arrest your Highness first. If I have offended you, I hope your Highness can forgive me. You speak too respectfully. Now I am a dying prisoner rather than a prince. But I deeply regret the situation. If your highness decides to find out the truth regarding the imperial order, I would like to follow you. But now I am on the run, and it's very dangerous to start the investigation. I myself don't even know whether I will live or die. How can I be the one to cause the ruin of your career? Prince, you do not understand. I owe my life to you. If I can serve your highness, even if it means risking my life, I will do it. Please. Don't reject me, your highness.
<coughs> you rabbits, bring me some wine. <coughs> I tell you, sooner or later, the first emperor will set me free. Your Highness, is that you? How are you? <coughs> General, I... I have come to see you. Highness, I is that really you? You were also thrown into this prison? This... this is awful. What shall we do? No, General. I pretended to be an Imperial Inspector to see you. Oh, Highness. I feel so relieved to hear that. Please forgive me that I can't salute you for the fetters. Here it is truly dangerous. You'd better go at once. General, I want to help you escape from this jail. No, it can't be, Highness. Yangzhou is a very critical town <coughs> on the border of the Great Qin Empire. Escapes from jail are impossible. You must not risk your life for the sake of me. But how can I bear to see you suffering here? Highness, it's all the same for us. Death awaits us all in the end. My old bones will not last long. However, you are the future of the great Qin, and you must take good care of yourself. Please do not disappoint me. Alas, I am not the crown prince anymore. The future of the Qin... Who knows? Highness, I feel that there was something wrong with that Imperial Order. Otherwise, I wouldn't have risked my life to help you escape. You must not despair. Instead, try every effort to find the truth. The sooner, the better. Hmm. You can say that again. Hopefully, I will still be able to help you get out of this place. Don't delay, Highness. You'd better act at once. General, you take good care. I'm leaving. Thank you.